Hello Geminis, welcome back to my channel. This is Divine Balance and I'm going to do the second half of June's reading for you guys. This is a general read for you guys, for Geminis. So do take what resonates, leave the rest, switch the roles if you have to. Do not pay attention to the gender on the cards. We all have masculine and feminine energy within us. Just get down to it. Let's see what this is about. Sorry, give me messages from Jim and I for the second half of okay. Second half of June, please, sir. Messages for Jim and I for the second half of June. Messages for Gemini, please, for the second half of June's third. Messages for Gemini. We have strong female has been through a lot, but it came in reverse. It came out in reverse, but we'll see that about that. What in the world? Excuse me, guys. Okay, sorry about that, guys. So, I'm going to leave that there. So, we got this strong uh, female in reverse. I'm going to take these that came out all together. We have bad deals. Half truths. And alone time. Now, it looks to me like there is someone around you, or this could be you. Like I said, take it how it resonates. Somebody that pretty much doesn't have their head on straight. They make bad decisions. They lie. Um, you know, or not even fully lie, as this card would say. But, um, that's better. But they, um, when they tell you the truth, they don't tell you everything. They tell you what they feel is what you want to know. Okay. Bottom of the deck, this person has bi bipolar disorder. They could have bipolar disorder, yes. Or this could be a situation where this person is different around you and different around other people. Could be. But this is about Gemini, so this could be you. Tell you how it resonates. Okay. Let us further go into what is happening with you guys. So, second part of June. Messages for Gemini, the second part of June, please. Search. Second part of June, spirit. We got weak, <laughs> superficial, jealous, and abusive. This person has a lot of issues, Gemini. This person has a whole lot of issues that you may not know fully about. And it looks like those troops are going to come out. This person has anxiety as well. This is crazy. This person has a lot of issues. Oh, oh. But there's a lot of stuff that they've been dealing with that um, they need to figure figure out. Someone needs time for themselves. So this person needs to be alone for a little bit so they can figure out what it is that they need to do. Why this is happening. Why they're going through such traumas and so many issues, etc., etc. Okay. Uh, let me see. So you, I don't know how 
just heard somebody say, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> this could be you. And this is why this person, this person has a lot of stuff that they haven't um, dealt with in their life. And they need to ground themselves. This is why they're weak. This could be a female around you. But there's a strong male card in that deck too. So this is a strong female that's feeling very weak right now. She may have made some bad deals. She may have lied about what she's capable of and who she is and what she does. And um, it's backfiring is from what I'm seeing because of all the lies that she's done. Or the lies that she's told. Excuse me. Um, what is this? Why is this not working? This is getting on my nerves. Excuse me, y'all. See if we can find out more about this female. Tell me more about this. Female, strong female reverse. Look at that. Clout hungry. Uh, says anything, does anything, makes shit up. Dramatic. See what I mean? We have travel. So this person may like to go to different places and pretty much puts a bad taste in other people's mouths. Damn. We got child services here. Uh, kids at risk of being taken or is about to reporting something, neglect and abuse. So this person doesn't even take care of their children. Because they're so busy clout chasing, trying to feel important. And then they take their anger out. <laughs> grudge holder then they take their anger out on everybody else and look at it girl fight at the bottom of the deck arguments physical fight at war competing so yeah they like to compete with people they like to start fights they like to start arguments that shit is sad so being around this person you better watch out if this is you you need to grow up messages for gemini for I'm going to put these back in the deck. It's a very interesting message as it is, but I need to finish my question. Messages for Gemini's for the second half of June. They didn't even let me finish. Gemini. Okay. All right. We got the Seven of Cups, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Four of Pentacles. You have another. Op you have new opportunities coming in, Gemini. Um, you have. You're gonna have a lot of choices. You have a lot of opportunities coming in, but you are holding back. It's like you're kind of guarded, so to speak. Two of Wands. You need to go a whole different direction from what you used to be. Go towards your happiness. Okay, you need to go towards your happiness. Um, it looks like you're, for some of you, it looks like you're holding on to your money and being greedy too. Like as soon as somebody gives you something, you hold on to that shit tight. So everything that you have, like you have all this, you have all the glitz and glamour and you got this opportunity coming in. Like every time somebody gives you something, they, you hold on to it. And I feel like this could be you or the person around you, this, this weak ass person. As soon as somebody gives them something, they hold on to that shit for dear life. Like they've never had anything before because they're greedy. They're club hungry. They're not going to give to anybody else. But if somebody gives to them, oh, they, they, they taking that shit like it's nothing. But they're still selfish, though. What's the seven of cups there? My seven of cups here. We got six pentacles, judgment in reverse, seven of swords. 
you have um you're gonna have the option to give to this person but it's a bad call because they're they're lying to you they saying that they don't have money they're lying to you so you need to be aware of that gemini just letting you know they may say i don't have this i don't have that i need money to pay my rent or i need to pay my gas and electric bill i need gas money all these different things but they have money they're just trying to hold on to theirs while they take yours seven of swords seven of swords magician motherfuckers trying to play in your face play in your face First of all, others of you, this could be somebody that's trying to manifest that you not be happy. Ace of Pentacles. Six of Swords. It's, I feel like this person wants money from you so that they can move on and have another start. And with the travel card with this person, they need money to travel. They need money to get wherever it is that they need to go. Nine of Pentacles. Yeah. They want to live this glitz and glamorous life. And they don't have that. Six of Swords. They really don't have all of that. So this person is trying to come to you with a sob story. Five of Cups in reverse with the Five of Swords. They're trying to come to you with this sob story because they need your help and all that. But, you know, they're losing a lot of money and now they're trying to compromise. They're, they've been defeated. Lies are going to come out. They, they lost a lot because of their greed and their, hungry to, and their hunger to be important. They're losing a lot. But now they want you to help them start over. Six of Cups. Yeah, they got you on the brain. See? Maybe I can get my fresh start from this person. Yeah, they got ill intentions. They got some serious addictions and obsessions. They are trying to get anybody that they can stuck on them to help them. Child, please. Four of Pentacles. Fool in reverse with the nine of pentacles this person feels stupid they're kind of hesitant okay they kind of feel foolish for um clout chasing right but at the same time some of you guys for some of you they um they're kind of hesitant to ask you for it let me keep going they're hesitant to ask for it, but at the same time, they're, um, hmm, hold up. For all, for those of you that this may be in a relationship, they're afraid to ask you of trying again. They could be afraid of being single as well. They see you, they're holding back, they're, they're seeing you happy. I don't think they like this. They see you being happy, you know, and you are their wish fulfillment, you know, Gemini, because lover's card is Gemini. They're, you're their wish fulfillment. They're wishing that we y'all could get back together. They're wishing that you would be able to help them, but I don't think you're doing it. The hell's attempt to get money from you. You could be hesitant of getting money from them. Child support is what I'm saying as well. Maybe hesitant to ask you for any child support. Uh, page of Pentacles in reverse. Because this person is fucking talentless and unbalanced. They want you to give them their head, their new start, their new beginning. They may try to take you to court for child support because they don't want to do shit on their own. Yo, they're going to come at you with some real shit, right? Like, five of pentacles in reverse with the ace of cups. They're going to be like, you know, I love you. I want to come out of the cold. I want us to start over. I need you to help me. 
fuck out of here. Their intentions aren't really that good. This person is losing everything and they want you to help them get back on their feet. And once they get back on their feet, they're going to walk away from you. That shit is sad. Let me just get one more. One more spirit. Oh, look. <laughs> I didn't see this. Eight of Cups, Hangman in Reverse, Ten of Wands. You're not helping them do shit. You're letting them go, letting them go, letting them go. This person is a burden. I can't do nothing for you. You really sit there and deal with the shit that you didn't create it. I don't have nothing for you. So you're going to walk away from this person. Let their ass go and let them deal with their own burdens that they created for themselves. Beautiful. So, Yeah. <laughs> You blocking the shit out of them. All right. So, Jim and I, that's your reading for the rest of June. Um, make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell for when I upload. I greatly appreciate you guys. And I will talk to you again very soon. Bye.